Hello makers, welcome back to Simple Innovation. Now I'm gonna show you a simple Internet of Things experiment, same as the previous videos. I will connect my Arduino Genuino Maker 1000 to my own Node.js back and server that deployed on OpenNode.io, then push the data into MongoDB database. So I'm using Arduino Genuino Maker 1000, a potentiometer, and also a DHT11 humidity and temperature sensor. It will post to my back and server with Node.js framework that deployed on OpenNode.io, then store the data into MongoDB database hosted on mlab.com. Let's get started. So here I've created a simple Node.js backend server that deployed on OpenNode.io. I call it IoT Lintang and we can check my backend server here. Let's request a uh, get request to my backend server then let's see the response from my backend server. Nice. This is my backend server's response and it means my backend server is activated. Then I've created a simple database on MLab mongodb database hosting i created a simple database called simple innovation then a collection inside this database called lintang iot there is no documents no data here okay let's try to connect to my maker 1000 i'll turn it on with 5 volts from my laptop using micro usb cable and it will pause every 10 seconds to my backend server okay led is on it means my maker 1000 sending the data let's refresh on mweb let's see the data here nice there is a data here temperature 24 humidity 53 and analog 1 it's minimum value also from my backend server there is a properties a property a call walk to or time it comes from my backend server Let's refresh again to see the next data. Nice. Second. Temperature 24, humidity 53, analog 2. Now let's try to maximize the potentiometer value. I'll maximize the potentiometer like this. And let's wait a moment. Okay, it's sending the data. Let's refresh on my MLab database. Nice. The analog 1023. So it works. That's it. A simple Internet of Things connectivity using my Arduino Genuino Maker 1000. Post to Node.js backend server. Then store the data into MongoDB database. My backend server deployed on OpenNode.io, then my MongoDB database, I'm using MongoDB that hosted on mlab.com. For full tutorial, you can check on link on description below. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and see you in the next simple project by Simply Innovation. Bye.